Hello, how's y'all doing? Okay, so today I'm coming at you with a review on this really cute vintage uh, tote bag that I have seen literally through the years and never even took a second look at it until recently. Um, and it is the Louis Vuitton Epi Plage, Epi Plage Lagoon Bay GM Clear Clear Tote. Okay, so before I jump in, I just want to bring your attention to the information in the description of this video. Um, I do uh, live shopping shows several times a week. I've got my mobile app up and running. I have my website up and running and I would love to, for you to be a part of my community. So if you would take a minute and uh, click that link that is in the description of this video, it will take you to all my social platforms and you can choose to join whatever you wish, okay? Um, so if affordable, pre-owned, luxury shopping um, of authentic items is your jam, then you're gonna wanna click that link, okay? Um, anyway, carrying on. Okay, so again, this is the um, <clears throat> Epi Plage Lagoon Bay GM. It was available in um, several colors. Apparently, it was from the 2001 line, so she, uh, I don't want to say old, she vintage, okay? I know I've seen it in red. I know I've seen it in, I believe, purple, and there could be some other colors, but this one is called white, but I have to tell you, saying, saying that this bag is white does it a complete injustice and I'll, I'll tell you about that in just a minute first let me just give you the measurements so at the bottom and it because it does have kind of an oval shape I literally just measured it from the very end okay across the middle so basically across the middle of where that fifth foot is okay so that area is almost like just right under let's just say 16 inches okay and then it is just right at 12 inches tall and then um, I just measured right across from the middle like here and it's seven inches deep. And then you've got like an eight inch handle drop. Okay, so depending on your size, you may or may not be able to put it up over your shoulder. Um, I guess if you're holding it like this, if you know, cause some women, they carry totes like this, like all the time. They always have their arm right here. Some people uh, carry them like this, you know, some people, whatever. I'm just saying like sometimes you see people when they're carrying totes and um, they have it like this. And um, for me, I have this big, um, the M prime I'm carrying right now the GG M Prime, GG, sorry, the Gucci M Prime tote, and I kind of do that. That's this is that's what I do with mine. But anyway, okay. So again, this was originally available in several colors, and to say this one is white is just injustice because the only thing that's actually white about it is the trim, the trim of the bag, the handles, and the bottom. That's all that's actually white, white leather. Okay. The rest of this, which you can see is kind of, um, well, is I have bubble wrap in it, by the way. That's why you're seeing some kind of faded. But um, you can see the epi texture, but it's like a vinyl, I don't know. The best way to describe it is like a vinyl epi, you know, whatever design you got going on. That's the back. Hold on. Okay. But as far as the color, this part, the body, this is not white. Okay. This is literally like a champagne, like a, a, a shimmery clear champagne if you could even say that because it's not actually clear i mean it's clear in the sense that like that you could say it's it's um like a frosted window it's like a frosted window but it's it's got this really pretty shimmer and i can't even fully capture it like in the video even but i know i can see here like when, kind of when i stand back you can tell like i don't know it may come across as kind of gray bronze but and that's not even accurate either. The, the accurate color, like if I'm looking at it, I've seen it in the regular light. It literally is this champagne shimmer, okay? Um, okay, so let me just show you the outside. So again, you already saw the bottom. It's white, white leather. It's got these big bubbly feet, okay? And there's five of them, which I love. And they're chunky too, they're chunky. And um, okay, and then you have the leather trim around the top. This is the detail, so it goes like this and then around. And then you've got the wider straps here, Okay, the hardware here that attaches, so that way your handles go all the way down. Okay, so it's easy access. Something that you would never notice in a picture um, unless you were looking for it and someone told you about it. But all around the trim, okay, on the outside and on the inside is LV embossed, like stamped. Okay, and I'm going to try to show you, but it's really hard to capture like um, white items in my videos or, well, on camera. So I don't know if you can see home. Dang it, it's going to be hard to try to show you this without, okay, let's try this. If you can see, dang it, see, oh, there, I think I got it. Okay, see how you see that LV around the top? 
it's literally stamped side by side, super close, all the way around. There, you can kind of see it right there. There you go. If you look over by my hand, where my ring is. Okay, that LV stamp is all the way around that leather trim around the top, on the outside, and the inside. <laughs> like, are you kidding me right now? Never seen that, never. In fact, I noticed it, this particular bag is sold, okay? I, I sold it today during my live shopping show, um, so it's sold, but I don't have it on a video, so I needed to do it really quick. <clears throat> now, the inside, um, some of them you'll see, you know, originally when they were launched, they came with pouches, um, you know, matching pouches. There's the D-ring for it. There's no pocket or anything. That bottom piece there, you know, the, the well, bottom, <laughs> this is gold. So it's a, the gold epi, and then, um, yeah, I, I mean, I wish that you could just really capture or really get the full idea of what this bag looks like. But let me tell you something. I know a lot of people are not really gravitating like white. Y'all, this would be the best absolute, I mean, this is a beautiful color. It really is. You have to take my word for it. You can kind of see, like, again, this is gold down here, okay? And it's still that vinyl with the epi underneath, and it's it's um, opaque, so you don't see anything through there. This is, you know, the rest of it's kind of frosted. And even as I just kind of turn it around, can you kind of see that shimmer, that kind of shimmer gold? Like, it's it's this frosted shimmer gold. And, and if you're seeing gray, that's wrong. It's not gray, okay? It's literally like a like a gold champagne. I mean, it is just <laughs> amazingly beautiful. It really is. Okay, so um, I recently posted a video, a uh, review video, or tour video of the LV, what is it? The Cobbus Cruise Clear Beach Toe. And that's this one, okay? This is a big mama right here. Big mama. It's like Cobbus All Toe family right here, okay? Now, this is like 18 and a half inches wide. You heard me say this is like 16 inches wide. So this is still a big mama. Now, compared to this one, not maybe not so much, but definitely because it is a GM and it and it honestly is would be like a true GM size. This would be very similar to you know like a never full GM, roughly. This is going to be like a GM XL or something, right? Anyway, after I post that video, I had a lot of people messaging me about this bag, wanting to know how much it is. Okay, this one right here has a very hefty uh, price tag. Okay, anywhere between depending on condition, anywhere between like I don't know. Um, what did I see? 2,500 plus. Okay. This one, okay. Today that sold in my live show was $500. Okay. So you're getting a completely relevant beach tote. Um, that is just beautiful by the way, completely seasoned, like matches the season. Of course you could even carry this as a daily bag, like in the winter. Okay. Winter white. Um, and also in the spring and summer. Um, I'm personally, I wouldn't carry it in the fall, whatever you do you, but anyway, this is a very, afford, very, very, very affordable, like a fraction of the cost of the Cobbus Cruise. Okay. Um, as, as far as the beach tote. Okay. If you're looking for something, if you're going on a cruise, if you're going on a vacay, if you're just going to the beach, whatever, and you want something that's waterproof and you know, kind of a workhorse, this is a great option. Really. It's a great option. This is going to hold up this one. Is definitely gonna hold up if you want something super swag to travel you know just on a, I don't know bus airplane uh, Amtrak whatever you got this is perfect for that too but this for some reason screams like cruise I don't know why I don't know why it just does like resort like I can hear those sounds those little Bahama sounds you know um, and then there's your heat stamp tag there in the back so you can still kind of see that shimmer do you see what I'm talking about oh my gosh anyway this is a very, 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 again, sorry, I don't mean to beat a dead horse, but very affordable option to the Cobbs Cruise, okay? Cobbs Cruise is an amazing bag, don't get me wrong. Watch that video, it, it is. I, I really, I can understand why it has the price tag that it does. But one of the things that I've always said and still do is that if you're wanting to get something that is equally, maybe not, okay, maybe I don't want to say equally swag, but if you're looking to save money but you still want to get LV, Consider um, something similar in Vernie or Epi, okay? Because that's where you're really going to be able to get a lot of bang for your buck, okay? And, you know, again, I I think this bag, honestly, is, you, they're not even, we're not comparing apples to apples here. This is still very bougie, this, in my opinion. Um, anyway, okay, I'm sorry, I'm just rambling because I was so, like, completely wowed by this bag when I, when I got it in. I was just like, oh my gosh. And it sold like that because people could really see the beauty of it and... Plus, I was excited to, sh I mean, I was even like, oh my gosh. Uh, but anyway, again, 
LV Epi Plage Lagoon Bay GM. And um, yes, it does come in a different size. I don't remember how many. I was just, I wasn't focused enough to be looking at all the sizes because I was, I just was looking for the biggest one. I knew it was a GM. So anyway, okay, so again, going back to what I said earlier, I would love for you to join my, um, my tribe. Okay, I do live shopping again several times a week. I've got my mobile app. I have my website and the links to everything is in the description of this video. So I hope to see you in one of my um, upcoming live shows.